61 by Carrie Kitchen with Carbones in Hartford South End, a classic restaurant. You got to go if you haven't been yet. And they're talking about their new Lenten table menu, which is just in time, obviously, for Lent. People are trying to cut out their meat. So we've got some great ideas with Vinnie Carbone joining us, of course, once again. And Sandro. Yes. Sandro's a little bit camera shy. So Vinny, you're going to do most fine. of the talking, He's but we're going to get a few, we're going to get a few <laughs> words out of you. All right, Sandro? No problem. So let's start off with what you're doing here. I'm doing a uh, paella with uh, mussels, clams, calamari, shrimp, and um, it, 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 yeah, and it's a paella. We're doing it a in the risotto Lent. paella, so it's kind of an Italian twist on the classic paella. This is one of the things this on is, the Lenten this menu. This is one of the things on the Lenten menu, and the recipe is available. But Lent is not new. The Lenten table for us is kind of new because people not eating meats during the Lenten season. Right. So we created this menu that you get a choice of appetizer. You get a choice of different entrees. The uh, pa risotto paella being one of them. Mm -hmm. And then you get a choice of desserts uh, with some wines to be paired with so them. So it's like a prefix menu. So it's kind of like, like a, a prefix meatless. menu that's meatless. Perfect. But basically, uh, and you know, Sandro's starting here, um, you know, the classic Spanish paella will have mm -hmm. some kind of a sausage or, or chicken. I but smell we're, the garlic and the white wine. But yeah, delicious. we're doing it in yeah. a similar fashion with mm -hmm. the clams, the mussels, the calamari, and the shrimp. And um, he's using a fish stock. Um, some white wine, and he's going to, you know, cook everything together. We're using an abario rice. Um, paella would normally have a different type of rice, mm -hmm. um, and uh, but it's, it's it's delicious. It's satisfying. It's healthy, and uh, and again, meat free right, for the right. month of Lent. Perfect for vegetarians. How long is it going to be uh, lasting? Uh, we are going to do it right up to the week of Easter. Okay. So we're doing it on Fridays. Uh, traditionally, uh, Catholics did not eat meat on Fridays. Right. Uh, they would be fasting, uh, abstaining from meat, you know, trying to, you know, just kind of, uh, you know, think about what the religious right. spirituality of, and you know, abstain. and abstaining and, uh, you know, Jesus basically dying for the sins of, of everyone. Mm -hmm. So that's so the basic premise of it. giving something up. Absolutely. And, uh, and but doesn't mean you have to give up taste. You don't have to right? give up taste. And, um, and so we thought this was kind of a cool thing to be doing since we do notice fish markets on Fridays during Lent. It's crazy. You drive yeah. by City Fish or, or whatever. And, um, and, the, and the fish, we do sell a lot of fish dishes on Fridays generally anyway. So it kind of worked out well for, for what we were thinking. This cod dish is another dish we're doing. This is a mixed grill. It has octopus, scallops, mm -hmm. and shrimp. Um, so he has some Brussels sprouts in there with almost like a, um, a it's like a tomato vinaigrette. So there's there's a lot of nice choices of entrees. Oh, it's really coming together here. I just wanted it to is. recap. So it's a prefix menu. It's forty nine dollars a person, but you choose an appetizer, an entree, and a dessert. Yes, you do. So you're getting the whole menu. It smells delicious. Yeah, Sandra, you're doing a great job. You are, Sandra. Anything are you, you want to add? Any, any recommendations or little tricks or anything on this? Not really. Just come oh, and no. try. Just right? come and try. <laughs> <laughs> right. Will do. You can find the recipe on our website and on our news app, of course. Sandra Vigneault, thanks so Thank much. Thank you very much. Guys, back down to you. Take care.